Hey, my name's Jim Peterson. I'm president of Homes Now. I was formerly homeless for 17 years and have always worked with homeless people. Uh, me and Doug Gupson were sitting in his bedroom talking and I'm like, what do we do? And he goes, I don't know. And I said, let's build tiny homes for the homeless. They all had a life before this. They didn't wake up one morning and go, you know, I'm sick of having a hot shower and I'm sick of having a bed and I'm sick of having a kitchen. Because we don't need to fix the homeless. We don't need to micromanage. We need to give them stability so they can fix themselves. Um, my name is Rachel Duvall. It was life changing for me. I, uh, I had family support. I had the support of friends and they were willing to help me at any time. It was important for me to do this on my own. It, it's a program that is meant to help you get back on your feet. But I have a place to come in and be away from people. I can lock my door. I can lock my window. I have a wind chime. Homeless people don't get wind chimes. There's nowhere to put it. What does Safe Haven and Winter Haven mean to you? It means safety. Um, I have friends. I have people that believe in me. Can you tell me where you were before this was your home? The comfortable sidewalk on Holly Street, Bellingham, Washington. And can you tell me the difference between where you were before you came here and where you are right now in your life? Confidence, stability. All I did was build a community. You walk around here, this isn't Jung's house, this is their house. We need to raise $90,000 for this uh, Unity Village, which would be 20 tiny homes, but we want to build four, so $360,000 holding this back. Plus, we need land. I believe in this, and the community believes in it, and the homeless people believe in it. So I guess I'll beg, you know, we need money.